friction. When one object moves across another, a force called friction pushes against it in the opposite direction, slowing it down. The amount of friction created depends on the type of surface, how rough or smooth it is. Friction also produces heat. You can experiment with this by rubbing your hands together. Air resistance. Air resistance is a type of friction. When an object moves through the air, the particles of air push against the object and slow it down. The faster the object moves, the more air resistance there is. You might notice this when you're riding your bike. When you pedal quickly or zoom down a hill, you can feel the air pushing against you. It is this same air resistance that pushes upwards against a falling leaf or a parachute, making them fall more slowly. Water resistance. Water resistance is another type of friction. When an object moves through water, the water particles push against the object and slow it down. The larger an object's surface area, the more water resistance there will be. Think about the shape of a dolphin, whale or shark. These sorts of shapes are ideal for reducing water resistance. This is why ships are long and thin with tapered ends, rather than being bulky and square.